This is the one and only Dark Master Moon 87 and welcome back to the channel. Now we're going to be rocking some more Samurai Warriors 4. We got Harry Potter, we got Yu-Gi-Oh, we got all types of shit going on in this battle. Now, as you saw in the previous battle, everybody got slaughtered. Bodies flying everywhere, combos galore, you name it. The stuff that you guys been wanting has been going on. So, without further ado, you're going to see a lot of magical shit happen on in this battle. Top of that, I got me an Xbox 360 uh, plug because the reason I got one is because the other one, some 4th of July shit happened to it, to make a long story short. And it basically almost blew the fuck up. I had to unplug it quick as hell, throw that shit right in the trash. It was crazy. Reason being is because I wanted to upload a video about a game that I haven't played in a very long time and it was one of those games that I give I would give it a straight 10 if it had all the characters in the game unfortunately it didn't but everything about the game was still fire so I give it a 9 it's definitely one of those games that you'll play to the point that you love it so much that eventually you'll try to level up, level up every single character in the game and then you'll fuck around and fall asleep on the controller because you still want to keep playing but your body's like fuck you you know so it's one of those games for sure but i can't wait to upload this game though honestly speaking because the game is, is fire yo like i can't wait to bring it back koei tecmo if you are listening to this you need to remaster that game if you're wondering what game it is hit me up on the dm and I will tell you guys, and I'm telling you, if you guys do this, everybody would be in shock, but the game would sell like a motherfucker. I'm letting you know that. Like, if you release it on PS4, PS5, Xbox, PC, all of that good stuff, even the Switch, I would rock that shit on the Switch. I really would. Like, I will play it nonstop. But if you do that, whoo, that'd be crazy. But there's a lot of there's a lot of new games that are that's coming out 2021 and I'm excited about it man like it, this I'm excited for uh, Scarlet Nexus I'm excited for a few of the Kobe Tecmo games coming out I'm excited for Blue Protocol There's a oh man there's a chosen few Back for Blood uh, all the MMO and RPG games that are coming out 2021, I'm gonna be playing. I might, I might not upload it to the channel like that, but I'm definitely gonna be rocking. It. So it's gonna be crazy. Like I'm looking forward to that, and the animes as well. Like I don't know if you guys um, check out Boruto, but I saw some shit today that had me cracking the fuck up. But if you're a Sasuke fan, you're gonna be pissed the fuck off. I'm letting you know that right now <laughs> because. I'm not going to even spoil it. You'll, you'll see what I'm talking about if you look it up on your own. But it, it was insane. I was I was not expecting that. I, I laughed out of shock, honestly. I said, whoa, what the fuck just happened to to the, to the one of the goats, Sasuke? What happened? But you'll see what I mean. And on top of that, um... <laughs> I'm probably like I, I noticed shots to swallow like I, I noticed um, one piece got these DLCs or whatever for these characters and I might make videos of my own about about it just to see how the movesets are and everything because I'm not gonna lie it looks it looks badass the characters from the latest one piece game I might buy the season pass just because of that and show off the characters I was also gonna Try out Soul Calibur's um, latest character that they brought back, Wong. Like I, I, I wanna, I wanna probably make a playthrough of son, man, cause I that was like one of my favorite characters in Soul Calibur. But as for the Muso games, the Gundam game, I don't, I don't know which one I'm gonna upload. It, it'll be a secret. How about that? But you'll definitely see a lot of gameplay from from me for Gundam, obviously, because you guys requested that, and you guys are gonna get that, man. You you get you get what you asked for, right? 
But yeah, I'm gonna it's probably gonna be Dynasty Warriors um, three Gundam and Dynasty Warriors Gundam Reborn, which is another underrated game. But Dynasty Warriors three Gundam had a lot, lot of nice Gundams, man. A lot, so, like it was it was fire. But what I want to know as well is what did you guys want? For Christmas, and I'm not trying to sound like Santa Claus or nothing, but I know a lot of you have like a Christmas list, and this is what you want, and that's it. You know what I mean? And I know some of you have your birthdays around the Christmas week as well. If you do, happy birthday. If it's today, if not, and I don't know what day it is, happy belated birthday. But yeah, I know my birthday. It's it's in January the 15th, so. It's gonna be pretty interesting, man. Cause my wife already said, oh, I already got your gift. I looked at her like she was crazy, but I got a few gifts. I bought my wife a gift as well. Big ass gift, but it's, it's gonna be pretty cool. And um, my kids, they both got about 10 gifts each. So it's gonna it's gonna be pretty nice, man. And uh, shout out to Jers. Jers, I don't know if you guys know, but Jers is actually the godfather of um, both my daughters. Which is which is cool and it's crazy as hell, but yeah, because we go way, way, way back. You know what I mean? But definitely, definitely gonna gonna try to do some dual comps, man. If if his if his wire's not a dud, if it if it is and it, it don't fucking work, I'll send him I'll send him a wire myself. Like I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure that these videos get out there because <laughs> I'm, I'm looking I'm looking forward to making new stuff on the on the channel bringing back old stuff a bunch a bunch of crazy stuff man I can't I can't tell you guys everything you know but it's definitely gonna be fun man. Uh, here comes the Harry Potter stuff man that this is why I call him Harry Potter you know what I mean he's the Samurai Warriors version of, of Harry Potter or a black clover character straight up like but I wonder like I'm trying to figure out because I always have it down to a science when Koei Tecmo releases games like I'm, I'm I always been on point with it for years like when I said Warriors Orochi is gonna come out this month or whatever whatever it ended up coming out same thing with Dynasty Warriors, Samurai Warriors. But I wonder if the next Dynasty Warriors game is supposed to come out next year. But I wonder what else what else is gonna come out, man, because Koei Koei Tecmo has been doing this surprise shit. Like surprise motherfucker. You know, and, and I'm trying to figure out what else is coming out next because I know the next game that they're probably gonna make is gonna shock everybody it's not gonna be a Dynasty Warriors game it's not gonna be a Samurai Warriors game and I know for a fact probably is gonna be from a certain anime and if it is I'm hoping it's a hack and slash beat em up version of Black Clover I'm, I'm hoping it's some crazy shit man because if they do that, which I, I know they can, like there's so many games, like I, I want them to make another Bleach game, have all the characters in it, have all the arcs in it, other than the, I mean, if they have the 100 year blood war, that would be insane, that would be crazy, but they can, they can, I know for a fact they can make that happen, I know what they're capable of, they make a Tokiden 3, that would that would be awesome, man. And so Keaton three, and you take some of the some of the stuff off of um, Freedom Wars, cause Freedom Wars, like the the battle system was hot, cause you could make a shield. There was a bunch of shit you could do in that game. But the messed up part about it was that you were locked up for a long time, like, and in order for you to get your years down, you had to. You had to do missions and everything, which I thought was cool, but at the same time, I'm like, damn, this this character got like 20,000 years. Like, what the hell I got to do in the game to get the 20,000 years down to zero? 
But it, it was a fun concept, for real. Like, they do make a Tokiden 3, though. Like, I'm wondering what what characters they're going to bring back, what characters they're, that are going to be new. Like, there, there's so many... There's so many things that you can bring up with Tokiden, and the crazy shit is, is that there's Oni in in Neo as well. So if they were to bring the Oni from the Neo universe to Tokiden, that that would be insane, yo. And then and then you see like the actual characters from Neo that are fighting the Oni in Tokiden three. Just, just a thought, man, because I know for a fact that that would be awesome. A lot of people would be hyped about that because Neo, Neo 1 and 2 did incredible, had incredible scores. And imagine Tokiden 3 just brings their universe and Neo's universe together because basically it is Oni and both. Even um, they can't do Oni Musha. Because that's that's a Capcom game or whatever, and from what I read, Capcom did some crazy shit to Kobe Tecmo, so that's out of the question right now. But if that was possible, the game would be insane. Like there, there would be so many people buying that game. Like, and then the the, the cool thing about Tokiden is that there's so many different varieties of weapons to choose from. If you don't want a spear, you can. You could range it out with a with a bow or a gun or some shit. You could have dual sword. There was a bunch of cool weapons in the, in the game, and then the combos were different. And then on top of that, um, the equipment like you can just keep building and building. It was like sky sky was the limit with that, you know. So that that to me was awesome. So if there was to ever ever. Make it to Keaton 3. All, all of us are going to hop on it. Like, and we're going to kick the, the shit out of that game's ass. Like, it's, it's going to be it's gonna be nothing. For real, for real. But let me know what you all think in the comments below about the Samurai Wars 4 playthroughs. I really would appreciate that if you were to share it and everything. Hit the notification bell to make sure you squat up on the... On the video, you'll be the first ones to know. Um, follow me on Twitter. I'm very active on that. Follow me on Instagram, Dark Monster Moon 87. And you want to know us to come or whatever, you can DM me. Stay ahead of the game. Those of you that are hitting me up on Twitter about everything, I really appreciate you all. And uh, there's more to come, for real, for real. It's gonna it's gonna be fun man. And as you see right here, I'm just making sure nobody grabs me and does anything crazy while I'm on the damn horse. Uh, here comes Harry Potter, man. I'm back with the Harry Potter stuff. Well, I'm about to end the video here. Dark Monster Moon 87. Thank you all for watching. Catch you on the next one. Happy holidays, everybody. Peace.